Isaiah 16 verse 1 says, Arise, shine, for your light is come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. I pray that this day, this wonderful day that the Lord has made, you will arise, you will shine, and the glory of God will rest massively upon you in the mighty name of Jesus. A very good day to you. My name is Nisa Samuel Kasali, and it gives me so much delight to welcome you to another devotional on the journey to marriage. Very quickly this morning, I'd like to speak to you on our of courage, the power of courage. Before we jump into it, let's say a word of prayer together. Father, thank you for this morning. Teach us your word, encourage us by your word, enrich us by your word, and bless us in all we do. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen and amen. Our Bible text this morning is from the book of 2 Chronicles 15 and reading verse 7. 2 Chronicles 15 verse 7. But as for you, be strong and courageous for your work will be rewarded. As for you, be strong and courageous for your work will be rewarded. The road to success is paved with so many setbacks, so many challenges, failed attempts, and anything that could discourage you. But the word of God to you this morning says, Be strong, be courageous, never give up. For your work will be rewarded. Many people don't get to success or don't become successful because they do not. Or maybe you've had some failed attempts. Or maybe the people and the resources you thought would support you are no longer there. The word of God to you this morning is be strong. Take courage. Don't give up for your work will be rewarded. Do not give up on yourself. Do not give up on your goals. Do not give up on your dreams. Do not give up on that thing that you are trying to achieve. Your work will be rewarded. Some people give up sometimes because they are failed. Failure is not the end of a thing, it's just an experience gained in the process. And you take that experience and you get right back to it. You get it. Many people give up because the people they thought would have helped or supported them when they started making progress, the people that could have, so if they thought would have supported them, left them. I want to tell you this, irrespective of who supports you or do not support you, keep running with your goal, keep running with your vision. If God has put that thing in your mind, God will wait to men and women to support you. They may not even be the people you expected. Believe me when I tell you that and say, I'm talking from even personal experience. Be strong and be courageous. Many people give up because of one thing or the other. Whatever it is, never give up. Those who give up never meet success and those who become successful never give up. Keep pushing. The day you can fly, fly. The day you cannot fly, walk. And the day you cannot walk, crawl. The day you cannot crawl, just keep shifting. By all means, keep moving forward for your work will be rewarded. Success is not easy. There will be prizes to pay. People will leave you. People will come into your life. Resources will finish. Resources will come. Discouragement will come. Discouragement will go. But if you never give up, you will get to that point. Again, the word of God to you this morning is be strong, be courageous, for your work will be rewarded. I don't know who is feeling discouraged under the sound of my voice. Do not be discouraged. Do not give up. As long as you keep taking that little, little one step, sooner than you think, you will get to the destination. Remember, when God sent the flood, every animal went into the ark. Even the crawling snail went into the ark. As long as they were patient to keep crawling, they got in. If you're patient to keep moving, you will get there. 
The Lord bless you in the mighty name of Jesus. Shall we say a word of prayer? Father, thank you for this wonderful word. Thank you for anyone under the sound of my voice feeling discouraged. Encourage them, O oh God. Don't allow them to give up, not on themselves, not on their academics, not on their careers, not on their business, whatever that goal is. Give them courage to keep pressing and help them send men and women to help them in Jesus' mighty precious name. Amen, amen, and amen. Thank you for watching today's episode of The Journey to Marriage Devotional. I trust you have been inspired to keep pursuing your goals and dreams. Just remember this, no matter what happens, stay focused and keep making progress. Your success is guaranteed in Jesus' mighty name. Please share this video to receive a surprise and don't forget to like and follow our page for more videos. God bless you and see you in the next video.